welcome back to Life in the Way. So, I've got a bit of a haul here. Just some fun stuff. So, this afternoon I had my physio on my knee. And for an hour or so it felt pretty good. So, yep, went to Value Village. <laughs> so, I got this goodie bag. $1.99. Let's have a look and see what's in it. It's got, it's so cute. It's got two packages of sticky notes and they're shaped like donuts. And then this one is a sticky note pad and it's shaped like a hot dog. <laughs> I thought that was cute. All right, then I'll leave that for last. This goodie bag. $2.99 and it's it's a memory game for kids but Dorothy and I um, as many of you know do the craft part of vacation Bible school in the summer for the kids and yeah we're already starting to get organized for BBS so I found this card game and it's you know those matching games where you have to match two cards but our theme for VBS this year is um, 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 like an African theme, like a jungle theme. I will remember. <laughs> anyway, it's that kind of theme. So, um, yeah, so these cards have like jaguars and rhinos and all kinds of different animals. So I thought they'd be fun for vacation Bible school. So I got that. And then, let's see. Of course, I'm collecting um, the little golden books for my daughter Brittany for her baby. So I found two more. I found a Paw Patrol's one and and Mickey Mouse and Mother Goose one. So they're only $1.49, I think. And they're five and six dollars at a regular store. So then um oh, hey Mr. Brody, would you like to come and say hello? Excuse me, I'll get him. Can you say hi? And say, Mummy bought me tennis balls at the thrift store. But I'm playing with them, so Mummy can't show you. Oh, yuckies. That was not a nice kiss. Okay, you go down and play. All right. Then, um, Dorothy and I, of course, many of you know, we um, are involved with Canadian Paper Crafting Swapping Group that we do crafts and swap them with people throughout Canada. And one of the projects that we did at Christmas time was we needed the clear sheets that hockey cards, you know, you can put your hockey cards in, but we needed them that were the size of business cards for tags and we couldn't find them in, in the city anywhere. And a friend of ours, Carol, who lives in Alberta, got some online and, and mailed us some, but I found a whole binder full of those sleeves, hockey, uh, not hockey cards, business cards still attached, but that's okay. I can refurbish these and use them. So we got a whole bunch. And then, um, now Dorothy didn't remember this restaurant. She doesn't think that they had it in Manitoba back in the 80s. But there was a restaurant um, in Ontario. I don't know where else it was. Um, but it was called Mother's Pasta and Pizza, Pizzeria. And these glasses, 1986 it says on it. I paid $1.99. And when you used to go to Mother's restaurant you got um, a pop ice cream float in these and you got to keep the, the glass and 
I found one. And I used to go like, you know, a couple times a month. <laughs> we had a lot of these glasses growing up. So yeah, I was pretty excited to find this glass. That is all I got at the thrift store. Oh no, I got a big piece of fabric with dog paws all over it. And Dorothy's gonna make the puppies some blankets and cushions and stuff. She offered to do that. So that's what I got at the thrift store. Then Kevin and I went to Ikea tonight and for the life of me, I cannot remember. And I'm so sorry if you're watching this video and you're the one that did this. I'm sorry. I can't remember what channel I was watching. But we, I saw this bread mix on somebody's channel. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Anyways, all you do is add water, shake it really well, pour it into your loaf pan, let it rise for 45 minutes, I think it said, and then bake it for an hour. So I had to give it a try. I yeah, When we were at Ikea, Kevin said, what are you looking for? I said, I don't know. I don't remember. I'll know it if I see it. And it was this. <laughs> so then... Um, oh, I forgot the last thing at the Value Village. I'll show you that at the end. Um, they, Ikea has these drink concentrates, and you, you mix um, one part concentrate to four parts water for this one. This one's rhubarb, and this one is one part to four parts water. And this one is blueberry concentrate. And this one's one part to six parts water. And it's uh, lingon, bitter, li lingon berry, um, which I think it's a berry out here at West. I forget. Anyways, I love it. Then... This one is one to six parts, and oh, my camera needs to focus. And this one is elderflower drink concentrate. So, give that one a try. I haven't tried that. Yeah. <laughs> and then um, we have all kinds of dinner plates, all kinds of saucers, bowls. We didn't have a lot of sandwich plates. Oh, okay, okay. And <laughs> Brody's attacking daddy. 79 cents. We got sandwich plates, so we got a, a dozen of them. So that's a good buy. We got chocolate bar. Gotta love Swiss chocolate. Then, oh, how much were these bags? I gotta. They are all two ninety nine dollars except for the big ones here, three ninety nine. Three ninety nine, okay. So they're Ziploc bags, freezer bags, two ninety nine. And this one you get thirty one liter bags and thirty fourteen ounce bags. So sixty bags for two ninety nine. We got two boxes of those. Then we got this one and oh, you get 25 two and a half liter, three quart bags, and 25 1.2 liter, one quart bags. So 50 bags for $2.99. We got a couple of those. And then we got the large, large ones. And these ones are, you get 30 bags. So you get 15, um, six liter, six quart and 15 4.5 liter five quart bags for $3.99. These ones were $3.99. So that's what we got at Ikea. And then go back to Value Village because I forgot to show you this. For $5.99, it's a bowl filled with jewelry. And I've bought these in the past. And what I do is I use all the different beads in different projects. I just repurpose all the different beads that come that come in it. Like here's a big button. 
so you know I'd repurpose that on on a craft that I'm doing and uh, like this one's cute oh it's a necklace that's all but it's a tie so I mean I could make a Father's Day card with that and uh, yeah I could spend a long time going through this but I won't do that right now but there's all kinds of different beads that can repurpose and <laughs> Brody's dragging around a piece of newspaper <laughs> so yeah all kinds of different beads and rings and buttons and lots of fun things so anyways that's what we got now oh I haven't talked about it recently but in the description below there will be my P.O. box if you send me a postcard or a letter saying hey I will make you one of my homemade cards to send back just make sure you put your return address on the envelope because I got a mail from somebody and didn't get a return address so uh, but I, I love snail mail it's fun right anyways Hope everybody has a great day. Kevin's gonna bomb the video right now. Yeah, I have peripheral vision. <laughs> we'll talk to everybody later. Bye bye.